Hi guys, it's Jess from Madden Crafts and today I'm going to show you how to use Canva to make a logo for your brand or event. You can actually create your own logo right in Canva from scratch if you don't have one already. But let's just jump in. If you look at these templates, anything that has this little frown icon, that is a template that's only available to Canva Pro subscribers. So you can kind of go through here and decide which template jumps out at you as something worth starting with. So let's just check this very first template and it's got room for a brand name and then like a little tagline. So I am just going to fill those placeholders in with my information. And now I've got what could be a very serviceable logo for my new brand. But let's say I don't love this font. I can go up here to the drop down menu and choose from the hundreds of fonts Canva makes available. I kind of like this script font better than the one that came with the template. So I can make that change and maybe adjust it a little bit, play around with it to see how I like the spacing. Now, this could be a finished logo, but let's keep our options open. If you go back over to the template list, because I have substituted my correct information for the placeholder text in this template, that will carry over to any other template I wanna try out. So let's say I wanna take a look at this one. You can see it automatically updates with my information. And there are tons of different options, like I said. Not all of them are going to be winners with your particular branding. So let's say I wanna try this one right here. You can see that one doesn't work with my brand and with my tagline. This would, I could make this work eventually, but it would probably require too much effort. So you can just go through the list and try out different templates, different styles. This one's really cute. And you can see this one comes with kind of an established color palette already and you can try out different fonts, different font effects. It's just a really good way to get a jump start on a logo if you are stumped. They are also fully customizable. So you can see here, not only can I go back and change it to that script font that I had before, I can make the font bigger. And let's say I wanna change this icon out because even though I love coffee, it doesn't really represent my brand. I'll go over to here where it says elements and this will give me a bunch of options. I would like to find a glue gun. And you can see now it's going to give me all options, graphics, photos, videos, audio, etc. I want graphics and I want to make sure that they are static only. You can have animated graphics in Canva, but you don't want that for a logo. All right, let's see, let's look at these glue guns. I like this one, and it happens to be a, a regular graphic, not a pro graphic. So I'm gonna take that, I'm gonna resize it to be about the same size, maybe a little bit bigger than the item that they suggested, the coffee cup. I'm gonna send it to the back just for a minute. Delete the coffee cup, and all right. There we go. That would be a totally serviceable logo for my new brand. And what you would want to do here then is go up to the share button and click download. And when you have a logo, you probably want to have it in a couple of different file formats. You want to have it in a PNG with a colorful background like this one has right here. You want to have a PNG with a transparent background, which again is a pro feature. And you probably want to have a horizontal version, a vertical version, a color version, a white version. You can do all of that here in Canva. Like this video if you learned something new. Subscribe to my channel if you aren't already. Visit me on my blog, maddencrafts.com, and thanks so much for watching. Bye!